Why are you looking at me like that? Are you catching it? If you're catching it, say, I'll catch you. Very good. Kayada. Jesus died as two goats, scapegoat and sacrificial lamb, and ended Levitical priesthood. So, all this one you hear people say, Redeem your firstborn is fraud. You didn't hear what I said. Anybody asking you to redeem your firstborn is a thief. He's trying to steal from you in the afternoon. People steal in the night. Redeem your firstborn from what? Why is he firstborn? What of lastborn? And how do we redeem firstborn? How? What will you use to redeem a man? Money, how much? How much? How much? So if you have to redeem your children, you who will redeem you? He's stealing in the afternoon. First Peter 1 18. Kibatole. For as much as you know that you were not redeemed, redeemed. You didn't hear that. You were not redeemed. Redeemed. It's like Namdi. Redeemed. <laughs> so redemption is a past tense. Somebody shout, I am redeemed. Say, I have been redeemed. So anybody asks you to redeem something is a thief. Because the scriptures tell us you have been redeemed. It's good to draw it so that the full impact can be felt. You have been redeemed. That's right. <laughs> I love the word of God. For as much as you know that you were not redeemed with corruptible things as silver and gold. So if somebody say redeem your firstborn with 100,000, it's a thief. Is a thief. You cannot redeem anybody with silver and gold. Case closed. For as much as you know, that means you have to know it. If you don't know it, they will steal your money. You didn't hear that. Somebody say, I hear you. As much as you know, you have to know it. You have to know it. That you were not redeemed with corruptible things such as naira dollars and euro yes, sir. Yes, sir. in fact naira dollars and euros are small he used precious stones silver and gold which is always maintaining value yes. it does not devalue yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. financial experts will tell you if you don't want your money to to reduce in value if you don't want to lose money use your money buy gold and keep for as long as gold remains, it remains valuable. It's more valuable than dollars. Gold is more constant than any currency. That's why he used silver and gold. For as much as you know, you're not redeemed with silver and gold. Hey, from your vain conversation. Received by tradition from your fathers. Next verse. But with the precious. Kaya, ya, ya, ya. Somebody shall precious blood of Christ as of a lamb without blemish and without spot. So Jesus died as animal. He died that animal death as a lamb. That death ended animal sacrifice. So when he died, he died as two animals. Scapegoat and sacrificial lamb in one. But the news is this on the third day when he rose he rose as the high priest so he is both the lamb and the high priest that's why when mary held him she said when she saw him after resurrection she grabbed him and held him he said she shouted raboni raboni that's to say i miss you you left us for three days we were looking for you we were hopeless we were helpless without you oh raboni she was holding jesus and just holding on to jesus jesus told her hold me not back don't keep me here i've not yet gone to my father 
your father my god your god that means i'm on my way as your high priest to appear before the father on your behalf i feel like i'm teaching here that's why when jesus appeared in heaven if you read the way the prophecy in psalm said it on the appearance of jesus god almighty looked at jesus and said thou art fairer than the children of men grace is poured into your lips therefore god has blessed you forever guard thy sword upon thy thigh O most mighty with thy glory and thy majesty in thy majesty ride prosperously because of righteousness and meekness and truth and your right hand shall teach thee terrible things in righteousness then god looked at jesus and said thy truth oh god is forever the scepter of your kingdom is a right scepter thou lovest righteousness and hatest wickedness therefore i god your god has anointed you with the oil of gladness above thy fellows so that was the inauguration of jesus as high priest general of the church he became the high priest and all of us became a kingdom of priests a kingdom of priests so we are a kingdom of priests. We are a priesthood under God. And everyone that is born again is a part of that priesthood. Meaning we pray, God answers. We cast out demons, they obey us. We rule over darkness. We rule over sickness and disease. We rule over death. Because we operate in, royal, in royalty as priests unto our God. Somebody shout, I hear you. I hear you. 